out to MetLife Stadium and you can see it's dry. Right now we just have, we had one shower push through. We're waiting for the heavy rain to push through MetLife Stadium. It's going to be tough in East Rutherford this morning, but again, tomorrow, it's the Giants and the Jets. I think that it's looking good for the forecast. I mean, it's going to be still muggy, maybe a mix of sun and clouds, but for the most part, the weekend is shaping up for Aaron Rodgers' debut. What a game that's going to be. But the weather game, oh, it's rough this morning. Sussex into Warren, points west. You can see right there, flood advisory in effect until 815. Here's the deal. We already have an inch and a half of rain out of this thing. There will be more rain filling in. That's why the advisory goes until 8 o'clock. Look at this right there, bisect bisecting Sussex County, Sparta, Jefferson, Mount Olive, all the way down into parts of Somerset County. And the problem is, this thing's just going to march right into Staten Island as well. So you have a lot of available moisture. You've got the atmosphere ready. Get ready, Jersey City. Get ready, Bayonne. Buy own? Why don't you buy to own? And then you have this line filling in. That's going to impact more of Middlesex, Monmouth County. Yeah, it's a process all morning long. The worst of it will be this morning. And then this afternoon, watch what happens. Timing this out between now and 7, it does hold together. That means the city, whether it's Staten Island or Brooklyn, you're going to see it. And then by 9 o'clock, it's still pouring in Nassau County. And now you're dealing with it in Westchester and Fairfield. So I'm just thinking, you're sitting at home right now thinking, what should I do? If you have to be there on time, factor in extra time. If you can wait, you are going to see better conditions by this afternoon. And then overnight Saturday, yeah, we'll see a leftover shower. And then the weekend, for the most part, is going to shape up. It's still going to be very muggy Saturday. That's why we have the possibility of an isolated shower, both Saturday and Sunday. But compared to today, so much better this weekend.